At Snake River Base Academy, we have over a decade of experience in helping new base jumpers safely reach their goals. We offer a variety of courses for new and experienced base jumpers including fundamentals of base, object avoidance and evaluation, and big wall tracking. For more information, please visit our website, www.snakeriverbase.com. Hey guys, Kip Hansen here at the Snake River Base Academy to present the three major types of rigs uh, manufactured today. Here at the school we've got approximately 70 different rigs on the wall, uh, but these are really the major three uh, types that you'll see uh, out there in use today. So the first one we've got is our Velcro rig. Uh, this is what's called a shrivel flap. It's what closes the container. You can see the bridle comes out via a bridle channel here. And then the mechanism that actually opens it is through this shrivel, where you can see it actually shears the Velcro. So what this allows it to do is to open in any orientation. So obviously, you know, uh, head low, head high, um, or any type of rolling orientation, it'll actually shrivel the Velcro and open the container, and you don't have to worry about uh, anything like that, keeping our container closed. Second type of container that we've got uh, is our one pin container. This works just like your skydiving rig, so obviously one pin closes all four of the flaps. The bridle is routed down the side via bridle flap and then out to the BOC. Pretty simple, pretty standard. Uh, you really don't see a lot of these in use today. Finally, the most common type of rig that you're going to see and the most common type of rig that you're probably going to use is a two-pin container. So, uh, like the one pin, we utilize pins to close the container. However, it's got two of them. So you can see in this case, the bridle's routed out the center. You've got the top pin, the bottom pin, a bridle channel, and then the BOC. Um, most people are probably going to be buying these uh, as they are really the best in terms of resale. However, you will see uh, all three of these types of containers out there in use today.